Dzień dobry and dobry wieczór, everybody. The Polish Pizza Pop is coming at you today at a place that literally, and I mean literally like yesterday, just opened in Seymour, Connecticut. See Seymour train station pizza. Look at Seymour. Literally the train station is like right across the street over here so I mean I just saw ads of this place yesterday over on Facebook and I said you know what I got some time I'm gonna head on over by the way yes I do have a winner for my Pepe's um, in Waterbury uh, pizza the, you know the, the winner over there I was looking for the guy the winner he wasn't responding back to me he finally responded he didn't have messenger I guess so I'm gonna be getting a hold of him in just about a couple hours saying hey you know let's meet up what I'm doing over here today is, yes, I'm giving away a gift certificate for this place, the new guys, as well as some cool shades that I had a picture of. I'm not sure if some of you guys saw a picture of Smirnoff Ice. They sent me some really cool sunglasses, which I don't have on me right now, but I'm going to be giving those away. So just wait for the Polish word of the day, which is going to be coming up in a, in a bit. In the comments below, just say Polish Pizza Pope, type Polish Pizza Pope, or just simply say that you know it, and I'll hook you guys up with a gift certificate to the new place here in Seymour. Here we go. Yeah. The Seymour Train Station Pizza. All right, guys. Let me show you the cheese goodness, thin crust. Here we go. Pretty nice looking, pretty nice. Hot right out of the oven, guys. Place is really cool. They got a bar, a bunch of tables. I mean, a really nice bar to tell you the truth. Nice place to hang out in literally downtown Seymour, where the train station is. Guys, can't wait to dig in. I only had some junk food earlier today. I consider pizza the best food ever. I mean, cheese, protein, dorks. What are you drinking? But today, it's only the cheese, guys. Here we go. That's a little slice of goodness, a little slice of goodness. Again, Polish word day coming up, which I have to figure out in my head, which hasn't been working lately. So, try that out. A little bit of a flop, but not too, too bad. I like my flop. Crust looks all good to go in a second here. Okay, guys, okay, guys. Definitely a different taste from all the other uh, pizza places here in the area in Seymour. That I could tell you right off the bat where it's not sweet, not sweet at all. So if you're... If you're a fan of sweet pizza, this isn't for you, but if you're a fan of non-sweet pizza, this is definitely is for you guys. Right off the first bite, you can tell. Again, literally just opened up over here, like yesterday. Today is, uh, what is today, Tuesday? Yesterday, Monday, just opened up. So everyone that's watching, support, support. The new guys in town. I love my thin crust. I grew up on a thicker pizza, Greek. But I love all pizzas. I mean, what pizza is bad? There isn't any bad pizza. Other than, you know, gas station pizza like Cumberland Farms. But anyways. Yeah. Definitely a little. Taste some herbs in there. Not too much on spices. Almost nothing on spices. Not sweet at all. Mm -hmm. Crunchy. Definitely crunchy. Again. Seymour, train station pizza. The new guys in town. A lot of competition, especially here in the Valley area. We all know about the New Haven area. There's a lot of great pizza all over the place. It's good. Again, if you like thin crust, there are a lot of comments coming in saying, we can't stand thin. Only like the thicker Greek style. Good. Nice crisp. Kind of reminds me of this pizza in Derby. I think it was called Derby Pizza. I think that's what it was called. I think that's the one that it reminds me of. 
We're gonna have another slice. Again, Polish word of the day coming up. Let's see if the, again, not too bad of a flop. Undercarriage, nicely cooked. It's good. Got pizza, you got beer? Got some vodka? I definitely would give this about. You know, like seven and a half, eight shot glass worthy of a Polish vodka right here. It's good. Nice and crispy. Awesome. Polish order today. Let me think. Would be. The way has started out the day today, saying Jin W to everyone. So, hello. Jin W is your Polish word today. Say that you know it below. In the comments, just say Polish Pizza Pope. Comment saying that. And I'll definitely hook you up with those Smirnoff Ice sunglasses, which I wish I had on me right now. Really cool. They're pink. They're cool. Maybe not for the fellas, for the ladies. And I believe they have gift cards over here, so I'm going to hook you up with a gift card as well. If they don't, you know, I'll get a gift card for Sutton, but I, I believe that they do. Because the last place I reviewed, uh, Zapartis, they don't have gift cards yet to my understanding, so I'm still going to hook up someone on my Zapartis um, pizza review. Guys, it's good pizza. If you're in town, if you're in the valley, driving down or up and down Route 8, there you go. There's the look. That's what's left. The rest is probably gonna go to my both boys, which are gonna hammer that down. Polish word of the day, Jin Dobry. Down in the comments below, just again, say Polish Pizza Hope, or simply say that you know, and I'll hook you up with the gift card. And those really cool Smirnoff pink, pink shades. Right in time for, hey, winter's just about over. So everyone, thanks so much for always watching. Again, where am I at, where am I at? There you go, it just opened up right there. Seymour train station pizza. Downtown Seymour, literally where the train station is over here. So everybody, God bless, um, be well, be healthy. There's a lot of crazy things going on in the world today. So, you know, prayers for everyone and things like that. So again, Thanks again for watching. I really appreciate it. Thanks for all the comments on the streets I get. Um, I love you all, guys. So, till next time, Jin Dobity Polish Word of the Day. Maybe I'll see you at the Seymour train station pizza. Till next time. Bye-bye.